So guys, today we're gonna be back with the Alpha 6 and we just got ourselves a 3D printer because it's only 3D printed quality so it breaks pretty easily and yeah so we're gonna just be ripping the Alpha 6 so see you guys then. All right guys, so this is my snowmobile. Uh, he doesn't have one, but he, we're printing one for him. I, we just printed this thing because we have our own 3D printer. We printed this really cool rear bumper. We printed some new foot rails, uh, black though. Bars constantly break, so we kind of just leave those. I do not know what that little orange piece is. Oh, we have a piece of trap that just fell off. I have to get that. Oh uh, yeah, the track is, dude, <laughs> the track seems to break lately. We, it's getting older. Yeah. Sounds like you're dying in the day, buddy. Yeah, I don't know what that is, guys. We'll catch when we figure that out. All right, guys, we don't know what it was. Something with the track, we just held it in the air, gave it throttle until it, you can see it kind of wore some of the plastic off, but. Rear bumper, that new one, especially in the orange. We'll probably go to the pool because it has it's kind of like a little skate park pool in there. So we'll put this video will probably be two battery life long. Not a good idea. No, not really. I was, it's pretty good. soft now. Yeah. It's been for a while. And it's like a little bowl. It's a bit high. And it's high because... I'm going to see wondering where you can get these files from it is mine is the alpha six so and i got it off you can get it off the, uh my mini printer right my mini factory my mini factory or you can get off uh rc creations pascal robert i liked his better because i just like the way it's designed better seems i don't know if it's stronger or what but and if you want a ski ride which is a little different it's got some more mods you can put on it I've heard, I don't know if it's much stronger or, or I, I, I don't know the difference. We'll be able to tell you that when he gets his. Once we print it, it's in the process. But yeah. But if you're wondering where to get it, either the Ski Ride Files 2, you can go just search up RC Snowmobile or Ski Ride or Alpha 6, uh, My Mini Factory. And then if you want that certain Alpha 6, you go to RC Creations. RC Creations. It'll say Pascal Robert. Sweet. That was actually a fan, bro. So, um, so we'll show you uh, a process on right now. Right now we're doing a side panel, and uh, that wasn't that good. Oh, uh, my bad. I didn't get that. I was talking to him. So, yeah, we got a side panel we're putting right now and two blue tracks, because I'd like doing, like, a black track with two blue pieces. And uh, we've already done, like, the frame. We'll just show you after... At the end of the video, we'll show you guys how the process is going, and yeah, it takes a bit, and now let's get back on the ski ride. I mean, Alpha, alpha 6, my bad. But well, we're yeah. getting better. It's actually a very fast machine. Kind of sucks. You know. I don't know if you guys can tell, but like we aren't even like we're gunning it, but like for a second, it's a very very fast machine. Yep. Very fast. Sometimes the frozen stuff, if you hit it on your track, you can break it. 
Yeah, don't go to the Don't really want to break a track right now because uh, we got the ski no. ride one, version one, pretty right now, and then it's, you know, just trying to get the ski ride done. Are you ready? Back off that rock, it'll knock a tooth off it. I don't actually snowmobile in real life. Like I want to. I want a snowmobile. Gear bike, ATV. I just want a snowmobile. Let us know if you guys want, like, in the comments down below. Woo! Oh, freak, man, that's a hard landing. Good? Woo! <laughs> Did your hair is crazy? <laughs> Yeah, it is. Hey you that hole. In the comments down below, let us know. Like this channel, we're gonna change the name to the Everything Brothers. Cause we fish. We don't hunt. We don't have license, but we will be probably eventually. When I when I'm 15, I'll get my license. We'll hunt. But we're gonna be like RCs, fishing, maybe dirt biking depends. Like all that good stuff. Uh huh. So. So just like. like for this season, it's more RCs, and then for fall and spring, it might be a little more dirt biking, but also RCs. Like, RCs are throughout the whole thing. Dirt bikes, too, can be in the winter. We Right now, it's a bit too deep. We'll probably just get stuck. But, like, we do drive in the snow. Oh! Drive us trying to get through the whole gate. say that the reverse key should walk on it. It's pretty hard. So it can steer now. Too. Yeah, I'm walking on it over here. And it gets really good steering in the hard stuff. And just with a bit of power there. Pretty, pretty cool. Let's go if you'd like to see more of it. Yeah, if you guys would like to see like more ski rides, like RC snowmobiles and stuff like that, just comment down below and Woo! And See guys, the track. I think the track is blocked. Yeah. The the track. Yeah, did you break another one? Dude, why? <gasps> That's how it's driven if you guys would like to know. <laughs> the bell drive. The bell drive. Suspension for the limiter strap. Yeah. Uh, I guess we'll catch you then once we get our uh, belt fixed up. I have a few spare uh, uh, pieces. So, yeah, we'll see you then. All right, guys. So, this is our little setup here. We have, like, you know, we have the table all here, all of our stuff. Uh, this is just down in the basement because I'm always getting the water everywhere. This is the 3D printer. Just show you that now. At the end of the video, there'll be a clip on, like, what we've done so far. All that stuff. So yeah, we'll just work on this right here. I'll show you how the track works. That's it. I'm not gonna bore you guys out. So pretty much, you got your track right on the end there. There's a little pin, and it should be going into that one. But this one had it, all the pins break open. So I just gotta grab some pliers and stuff. Okay, guys. Then once you get your pliers, you should grab the pin. We can pull it right out. It's just I think it's 16 gauge. I don't know. I think it's 53 millimeter. So we actually, we only have, so we do only have one broken track piece with all the broken links, as you can see. So then you actually, normal, there's, that's actually a new track piece. I think we, sh we didn't print these at 100 infill guys because we didn't really know much. That was like, we're new to 3D printing, right? So 
once I get this piece of plastic out of the way, so pretty much you can see you melt the plastic and you cover up the pinhole, I'll, I'll get the pin out and then I'll show you what's next. See now as you can see guys, it starts pulling out and you just give it, uh, you might have to twist it, Woo! pull it out and there you go. And then you pull the track piece off and you get the same one sided paddle and you put it on. Then guys, get the other track piece, slide it on, hold it upright, uh, get your pin, push it down the hole. Uh, sometimes it doesn't line up the best though. That's a problem I have. And then what you can do, once you get your track piece, uh, see this one, it's supposed to have this flap that you heat up and down, but this one, since we took it off, it just comes off. But I'm gonna just heat it up and a little lighter. I don't know why it's pink. Got a pink one though. Just heat it up. And then I'm gonna try to like pinch it with uh, some pliers to pinch the plastic on it. You don't have to heat it this long, but I am. a little bit pinched just gotta do it one more time and then you got this track ah it's freaking hot forgot about that then you get your track well i guess you need to get, you need to get it on I'm trying to show you guys from here hopefully that's a good view i don't know you gotta get your track the right way because it has a certain like it has a certain way to go you just lay it like this and you just roll the track can't really see but you just kind of roll the track piece through here and then once it gets to that thing, that yellow thing down there, you can just twist that and it'll pull the track piece through. And then once it gets far enough, you should grab the track piece, pull it the rest of the way. Pretty much just as far as you want it to be. Bring it together like this. You find your pin. I'm gonna have to find my pin, guys. Guys, I couldn't find it. I lost it. So. <laughs> got some wire right here 16, 16 gauge, gauge. Uh, I don't know the length so I'm just gonna stick it in there now I don't know what strap piece it is though oh I see what strap piece it is well I thought I had it before that's a trick question right there <laughs> Ow. then get your cutters right here Oh, actually, I'm oh, yeah, on that's length. That's perfect, buddy. You didn't know they had cutters on, did you? No, like, I meant. <laughs> no, I know, I was cutting the bendy endy. Look at how bent that is. I'm just gonna cut. Alright, before we got, we leave, we just wanted to show you. That's what it's supposed to look like right there. That little flat piece right there. I don't know if you can see it right there. You just hit it with the lighter and you use your finger boop, or a screwdriver or whatever and then you just put it down. So we'll catch you when we actually get out there this time. All right guys, we got it uh, fixed, up and running. It breaks. Like, it has a very big, like, uh, let off, and it just breaks. This combo. If you guys are wondering, actually, if you guys are wondering the combo, it's, I think I put it in the, I think, I'll just say it now. Um, the Spectrum Firma 85A. Uh, I think it's the 3600 KV. I think it's that one. 36, 38, 32, 33. I don't know. It's not one of those numbers.
pretty, pretty sick. I can't wait until I get a mine full grid, and I hope it's done. And oh, your pom 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 fell off your hat. What? Right there. Bruh. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. So. Yeah. So. Hopefully I can get it done and I can rip it this season and we'll have a little oh, video of both. And then we can have a little video of both and then just compare them. Oh. But obviously it's still a while because that's a lot to 3D print. Yeah. And we only have one printer. So bouncy, I don't want to go any faster than that. It's not like one of broken out of the pizza. <laughs> you see if the track's too loose or something. You ready? I don't think. I think I'll just, I'll just dig. Yeah, I'll just dig. But yeah, talking about the chain tightening. Yeah, we don't want to tighten dirt bikes, but there's still a big difference between an RC car and a dirt bike chain. See, it has plenty of power with that spectrum motor in it. We also have a Dumbo RC controller. That's how deep it is, so it doesn't have that... So you have to get through that layer. So much power. I wonder if it's a good you can go fast. And then right here is like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. Fall apart. Yeah. Like a track piece, guys, that's not bad. That's a quick thing. Yeah. Ooh. Track pieces are very, very. Yeah. yeah. I just gotta get low here. Oh. Get my head off the fence. Oh, it's dead, guys. It's dead, so... Yeah. That was actually smooth. Uh, yeah, are we gonna catch someone with a new battery, or...? Yeah, guys, we'll catch you. We'll get a new battery, because yeah. we'll have more fun this time. Yeah, well, we just got to charge up this one, so... So, yeah, we'll see you then. All right, guys, now we got the new battery, the fresh battery, or same battery, just charged up. Alright guys, we're outside now. Got the arm fixed up and the dog's away, so. Wait, my dog is so. Do something real quick. Ah, no. I thought she was put away. She's here now. Spooky. Go that way, buddy. Go that way, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, I was talking about it. It's actually a real mountain sled in real life. It's an Arctic tie opposite. They're pretty cool, but you know, don't really have enough money to get the newer ones. Just just the RCs for the start, but you never know. Could gradually get better and start getting like uh, the real, real deal. And uh, we're gonna be, yeah, now we're just gonna go to back to the sled.
can't keep on can't keep on doing that, Ray. You made it. I know. Oh, you broke the bumper, didn't you? No. Hey, then. Oh, the actual bumper too. Yeah. Not just that little bit. Little bit. That's a sender. You guys can't see? That's level ground, and then that's just a jump. You guys can't see it, I don't think. But we're gonna get over there, and we're just gonna send everybody. It's gonna be sweet. See, look, it's just like... See that drift? I don't know if you guys can really see it. Will you make it? Oh yeah. See your heads. See your heads. It's really digging at me. Really, really soft. Man. Do any like jumps and just like keep it wheelies and Track, isn't it? If it's a track, he's no. There goes the track. I think that might be the hard stuff. Is that like. Is that ours? Well. Do you even have another spare? Yeah, I think I will. Might be the wrong Last side. Last one, but. though. Oh, I. you doing that. So. So, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace. So guys, I know that we said, whoa, my face is really red. I know that we said that we would be finishing off outside, but I wanted to show you guys how 3D printer is going. Oh, uh, wait, let me go get the light uh, here. I'm sorry for the delay. Got the lights on. So we're gonna show, I'm gonna show you guys how it's going. So right now we're putting the track in the right side panel. Let's see how it's going. It's looking pretty good so far. Doing pretty good so far. We got the track there. Got that. And it's at 30, 30, 30. Okay, so it's at that 30 something percent. That's pretty good. And we have, we've gotten the frame done. As you guys can see, frame done. We got a uh, front panel. Uh, this is a bit of the track, not much at all. Uh, dude, I got it, I got it on top of my head. Drive shaft and gears axle. This is where we put everything right in our bin, right here. So it's pretty nice. And it has a ski red one on it because we also have the alpha. And yeah, so don't forget to like, comment, and hit that subscribe button. And see you on the next one. Peace. Thanks for watching. And see you on the next one. Peace. So guys, I've always won. So I know Rain's going to see this. So I'm going to like be like <laughs> really crazy. It's going to be like really radical. <laughs> so yeah, see you guys.